We are at Pro Direct Play in Shepherd's Bush for the Pyro Storm Cup, where the Mighty Oxford Royals are gonna go up against some of the very best five-a-side teams from YouTube. Bring it on. And there's a special guest, Belgium and Chelsea's Michi Batshuayi with the trophy. The rules are simple. No, they're not. They're quite complex, so listen up. There are eight teams in total, two groups of four. The top two qualify for the semis and the final. Five-a-side matches, 10 minutes each. Players can't go in either box. If they do, a penalty is awarded to the opposing team. No goalkeepers. Instead, there are four holes in each corner of the goal. The players have to score in. If a goal is scored, the opposing team loses a player for the whole match. Representing Oxford Royals, Ed Lee, Tom Resch, Ant Wilkins and Chris Self, Nick Smith and myself, Captain Adam Smith. First game is against Astrius F. See, as the game gets underway, good bit of spell this mock shot. And Nick Smith with a nice finish to make it 1 0 up shot, which means Astrius are down to four players as part of the rules. There's Anthony to make it two. No, the wall, the ball, should I say, cannons off the woodwork. This bit of wood really does cannon the ball off if you don't find the corners. There's Ant again, nice bit of dispossession. And an Astrius player has gone into the box. What is the ref going to do here? Clearly, in the rules, they state that you can't go in the box if you do a penalty is awarded to your opposing team. So Ed Lee slots it in to make it 2-0 lock shot and Astris are down to three players. Nice turn from Ant. Ant has a shot off the wood. Tom has a shot off the wood again. I have a shot. Oh, it's a nice finish from myself. Finding the bottom corner. Yeah, my team's a big side, man. They're a bunch of lumps. They don't seem that good, though. Ant makes it 4-0. Lovely finish. We're all over them. And there's Ant again to make it 5-0. Not bad for a bunch of lumps that don't look very good. Oak shot was 5. Yeah. The other team nil, yeah. <laughs> right, lads. First game, five nil. Eliminated them before the end of the time limit. Good one. Yes, yes, Play yes. one, one, one. Come on. <laughs> Next game is against Brentwood versus Cancer FC. First kick of the game, Nick Smith. Oh, it's one nil already. This is Brentwood versus Cancer FC. You do a lot of great charity work in Essex, and there is me with a lovely little challenge there for myself to prevent an equaliser. How was the second stint, mate? Mate, good game this. Good game, Coming. tough one. Playing well, aren't we? Finish, finish. Doing all right. Where are you? And it looks like we're playing three hours later because the light is suddenly gone. Maybe the clocks have gone back as Tom takes the ball forward. And it's a shot that Tom won't want to see again. That looked like it went closer to Chiswick than it did in the goal. And we're nowhere near Chiswick as it's a shot from distance. Oh, what a goal that is from Brentwood versus Cancer FC. Possibly the goal of the game because it's from absolutely miles. And that is one all, which means Oxshot are down to four men. But Tom quickly restores it. Chris Self getting giddy because he's never been that far forward. And he managed to hit the cameraman, but granted, he shouldn't have been stood there. Oh, Grant, take him on there, mate. <laughs> so it's Oxshot two, Brentwood versus Cancer one. And that is another goal from Oxshot, making it 3-1. All Oxshot at the minute, nice bit of spell, this good turn from Nick Smith there. Anthony Wilkinson with a nice dummy. And there is Ed Lee, lovely finish from Oxshot. It's another goal from Oxshot, all Oxshot Royals. There is Ant, we are toying with them. There is only one player left because it is 4-1, it is now 5-1. It's another whitewash, Oxshot win. Ed Lee, I don't know what Ed Lee's pointing at because his name isn't actually on the back of his shirt, but anyway, that's Ed Lee for you. Come on the Oxshot, play 2-1-2. Two, two. Next up for us in the group is the Tango squad, who are favourites to win it because they've got some semi-pro players playing for them. But Nick Smith makes it 1-0 straight away. Lovely finish from Nick, who's been our top goal scorer so far. And Tango squad are down to four players. Nice interception from me, it's a shot from me. Oh, it's hit the beans on toast. Wait, come on, come on, we don't like we don't want to play, come on. This lot have been coached by some Premier League players. But Ed Lee makes it 2-0. Ed Lee has the foot. Yeah, it's decent. You know, I think I'm the best player at the minute, to be fair. That is good. And Ed Lee's already awarded himself the player of the tournament after only two games. And Ant, oh, what a what goal that is from Anthony Walkinson. That is 3-0 Lockshot Royals. The atmosphere is electric. So many people. Tango squad are not happy. They are down to just two players. Ball through to me. It's a lovely finish for me. That is goals from Adam Smith, from Ed Lee, Anthony Walkinson. Everyone getting involved in the goals here. And can it be another whitewash? Can Oxford Royals make it three whitewashes out of three? Yes, they can. There is the final goal. They have played three, one, bins, three. Then? All five players are off the pitch. Why are you not back yourself, top bins? Right, semi-final time. Oxford Royals against, what's the name? Mo Shambles. Mo Shambles. So here comes the semi-final. Mo Shan was the youngest and the fittest team in the tournament. Apparently a wild card entry as they won a competition to enter through social media. So we don't know what they're like, but they finished runner up in the other group. So it should be a good test. And there is Tom straight away, making it 1-0 to the Royals. Good start. Hammering them. Sorry, mate. Not hammering them. I mean 1-0. Yeah. <laughs> it's fine, it's fine. <laughs> There's Nick Smith in the corner, so nice finish from Nick. That is 2-0 straight away Oxshaw, and they're looking very frustrated, this team. Uh, another little shot there, and Ed Lee. Oh, off the, off the woodwork from Ed Lee. Won't want to see that again because it's from close range. But unfortunately for him, Peter's put a replay in of that miss. 
And there it is. Chris Self, the only player yet to score for Oxshot, but he's doing some great defensive duty for us because he's well the only defender we've got in the whole team. As Ant has a shot from distance, a lovely finish from Anthony Wilkinson. It is all Oxshot Royals again. Here is me on the ball. Oh, nice little disguise pass for myself. Through to my brother, the Smith 1 2. And that is another whitewash. No, it's not. Sorry, there's still one player left. Still one player left. It's five versus one. We are toying with them. And we're teasing it about. That's a pass from me. Pass to Tom. Tom surely got finished. No, Tom's missed it. Back through to Nick. Nick through to me. Me to Nick. So Nick Smith and Adam Smith. Smith 1 2. And the ball is in the back of the net. Oxshot Royals advance to the final. Great effort, lads. Well done. Sorry, man. Get in. Well done, mate. Are you going to score a goal today or what? Mate, I'm clean sheet. <laughs> no, you haven't got a clean sheet. <laughs> so there's our manager, Chez, getting in selfies here because he hasn't scored yet, but he's done great at the back. We are playing the final. It's Oxshot Royals against Pog Boom from the Adidas Influencer Network. Uh, they have got some academy players playing for them, so it should be our toughest test yet. As they get the ball underway, nippy little footwork there from Pog Boom. And there's an appeal that they're in the box, and that means that there might be a penalty. What is the ref going to do? Yes, he's clearly in the box from the Pog Boom players. I didn't get out the aerial. The ref has given a penalty for encroachment in the box. There is Tom with the slowest penalty you're ever likely to see, but it doesn't matter because it's 1 0, meaning Pog Boom go down to four players. It's five on four in the final. Oxshot winning 1 0 as Michi Batchawai is watching on from the sidelines. Dispossessed from Edley and the ball's taking a weird spin. Oh, is that gone in or not? Can't quite see from that angle. It looked like it may have crossed the line. A wicked, wicked deflection there. Backspun into the net. No, it's not over the line. We might need another replay to clear that up. A freak deflection, but clearly you can see the ball has not gone over the line. Pete Holloway, the producer, putting a fourth replay in for no apparent reason, but it's the right decision. It is no goal and it's still 1 0 Ox shot. Get out, man! Oh. And they're losing their heads a little bit, Pogba here. It's a shot for myself from this. Is, oh, it's a lovely effort from me. But it's hit the beans on toast and Anthony with the rebound. Let's have another look at that. I have a shot from distance. It's hit the post. And Ant with the replay. It is 1 0 Ox shot. The next goal is of huge importance. Here's Tom. Surely Ox shot. And there's Ant. Surely this is the chance. Oh, it's hit the post again. Ox shot hitting the post. Can't seem to get the second goal. Mitchy Batchwa looks like he's loving it. As they have the ball. And Pogboom losing their heads a bit. They just push Nick off the ball and they're going for an ambitious long shot, but it is dramatically wide as Ed Lee pushes one of their players off the ball. Get on the weights. Oh, what a move that is. Ed Lee doing it all himself to make it 2 0 ox shot. It's a huge goal in the game. As there's another kick out there, they're losing their heads a bit. That is a late challenge, and the ref is having a word with one of their players as we get the game back underway. Still all ox shot rules. Anthony dispossesses man. Oh, what a finish. All Oxshot rules. So many goal scorers getting on the act. Nick Smith with goals. Ed Lee with goals. Anthony Wilkinson with goals. Adam Smith with goals. Tom Resch with goals. And Selfie doing well at the back. And there's Selfie again. It's a lovely pass. Oh, it's a nice pass from Selfie. Opening up to myself, Adam Smith. And there's the goal. <laughs> Nice finish for myself, but lovely footwork from Chris Self, who's been a rock at the back for Oxshot Roars. Luckily, he's here because he is the only defender doing it all by himself. And we have... Oh, Michi Batchwise, come on! They're down to one person, Pogboom, in desperate need to suddenly score four goals. So, Michi Batchwise, come on. No one wants to tackle him because we're afraid of injuring him. Uh, and also, probably getting nutmegged at the same time. So, Ed Lee is holding his ground. Um, must be pointed out that Mitchie Batchel absolutely bossed it against Watford, scoring two goals. But so far, he can't seem to break down the Oxford Royals' back line. Uh, does that mean Oxford Royals are better than Watford Football Club? Let us know what you think in the comments section below, as Mitchie Batchel is showing incredible footwork, to be fair. He's in the area, ref! Ref, he's in the area! Oxshot just chasing that last goal to win the tournament. It's a chance from Ed. Oh, it's off the wood. It cannons back off the wood as Nick Smith has the ball. Surely it's just a matter of time now. There it is. There is the winning goal. Mitchy Batshuayi looks gutted. It is Oxshot Royals 5. Pogboom nil. Another whitewash as Oxshot Royals win the Pro Direct Pyrostorm Trophy. And they've even put on some fireworks in Oxshot Royals red and white colours to commemorate the win. They are talking about this all up and down the country. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel. See you later.